Hi everyone. We're going to run through the steps so you can monitor your Spark environment from using the metrics library that's included with Spark. And then we're going to show how to create some graphs using Grafana. This screencast is meant to accompany the blog post from wherever this video is being shown. So there should be a link to the blog post or it's actually within the blog post itself. I'm going to go fairly quickly here because all of the steps that I'm running through should be described in the blog post as well. So I just want to show you quickly what to do and let's begin. So I'm going to start off by showing you that Spark is running on my local machine and I have one worker running. Next in the a patch in my uh, where I have a patchy Cassandra installed, I'm in the bin directory and I'm going to start this up with dash F. And as this is running, I'm going to go over. You'll see I have a bunch of shells here that we'll dive into. But next, I'm going to go to SQL. CQL, excuse me. I can see that Cassandra has now started up. I'm going to go and I'm in the killer weather data directory. So in previous steps, we've cloned killer weather. Now I've gone into the data directory and I have a couple of CQL files here, which we're going to run next. So I have this in my cache. I'm going to start up the SQL shell. And then I'm going to source the create time series. And then I'm going to source the load time series script. Let's see what we have here. Okay, we're looking good. We have the tables we need. Next, let's go over and start up the app portion of Killer Weather. So we're just going to do SBT app run. As you see here, I'm in the root of Killer Weather. And we should see this fire up. Next, I'm going to go over to Another shell, I'm in the root of where I clone killer weather. I'm going to uh, package the streaming module. This is going to go very quickly on my machine here because I have already done it. So it happens very quickly. Let's go back and make sure the app is running. It is. Let's see everything's going fine. So now we're able to deploy that jar to our local running spark master so i'm going to go into let's see again we go into killer weather streaming we should have a jar here that we can deploy this one here i have this in my cache again so you can see this command which is also on the blog post and we're going to run it It's a streaming job, so pretty soon we'll start seeing that. Yep, so it's good. We're running. See the running application here while they're streaming. So now let's go to hosted Graphite. We're going to create a new dashboard to display the metrics that we're creating. So we're going to go to dashboard Grafana or Grafana. Click up here, we'll go to dashboards and we'll say new. Next, we'll click this green button, this green area here, and we'll add a panel for graph. And we'll add a metric. If things are working correctly, we'll have Ajax driven availability here. Well, let's go into JVM, click that, let's see what else we can do here. Let's take a look at our heap. And then let's wildcard it.
we can change the panel title to heap and we are actually showing metrics here so cool what other metrics can we display here well we can also add another one here and the graph you can see here what we have but i also wanted to show you back in the hosted graphite in the overview section here if you go under dashboards oh I must have gone a little too quickly here i'm going to go back dashboards graphite composer we can see what we're collecting if we go under metrics and we can see master you recall from when we configured the metrics property file here's some of the things that we did so let's also take a look at this the worker the way we would go back then and create a dashboard for it we'd have worker and then let's just wildcard that we can create a new title for it So you can see now we're creating graphs and displaying them in an easy to use manner. So that's it. I wanted to show you the ways that get you started. Hopefully this helps. Uh, and let me know if you have any questions or concerns. Thanks.